The Tacoma Tide Flats has a rich history of shipbuilding. At the end of a 180-acre arm of land between the Blair and Hylobos waterways sits the port's early business center, the location where Todd Shipyard set up shop to build ships during World Wars I and II. This area and its 30,000 employees buzzed with activity throughout World War II, but ceased operations soon after the war ended. In 1959, the Port of Tacoma bought the Todd Shipyard's land and buildings, and in the decades since, it has been home to a variety of businesses. Today, we are excited to see this area start to hum again as the home to Silverback Marine, Safe Boats, and Motive Power Marine. The biggest attractor for us at the Port of the Tacoma was actually the people. Um, very manufacturing friendly. Um, they wanted to help. They wanted to stimulate small businesses. Motive Power Marine has been in the port for, since 2016. We came over here, saw this site, and it was just absolutely perfect with the ramp and the way that we haul out vessels, which is airbags. Because we build a boat from you know, bare aluminum sheet all the way up to a completed boat, um, relies on a lot of suppliers, um, subcontractors, a lot of partners to help us build the boats because ultimately it's really difficult to try to be all things and um, to have everything under one roof. I want to see us working together, not against each other, um, because everybody's good at some certain segment of the market and we can share each other's resources, uh, swap ideas, and that's been very successful for us. As we're looking toward Tacoma as a headquarters for our large craft production, the support that we're getting to create kind of a, a regional funnel for people and supplies and materials um, and everybody's willingness to coordinate and um, cooperate on those efforts, I, I think really sets the region apart um, and that, that will make all the difference for us. The Tacoma facility for Safe Boats was originally set up in about 2013. In total, we built 12 Mark VI patrol boats for the Navy in that facility. Recently, uh, the U.S. Navy awarded the company a contract for um, now eight additional Mark VI patrol boats. Um, we will reopen the facility and start hiring um, just about mid-year this year. Um, and then the first boat will go into production in that Tacoma facility in about August. There's many skill sets, everything from upholstery to painting to welding, and there's something for everybody in building a boat. Hiring enough people to fill all the positions that we have, it's going to be one of the biggest challenges that, that all of us face over the next few years. On our end, we'll take some of, the, some of the individuals that maybe don't have the experience, but they have the desire, and we'll bring them up from the time that they come in here and we'll get them welder certified and so on and so forth to make sure that we, we do have you know, the labor pool that we need. That's always been motive. We want somebody with the right attitude, with the right drive. Um, you can teach, you can teach anything, but you can't teach the drive. Boat building is a, is a very rewarding career. Um, I see a lot of opportunity for uh, kids that are growing up, graduating from school. It's an industry where you get to see the fruit of your labors. Tacoma is also strategic for us, for our employees, many of who are on the peninsula. Um, we can get some employees from Seattle as well, and our vendors. It's, it's just a perfect manufacturing hub, and it's just got that maritime vibe to it. There's nowhere else in, on the West Coast I would want to be.